Do you know 70% of the earth is covered in water, but only 2% of that is pure, clean, drinkable water. How to drink seawater? What happens if we drink seawater? How to turn seawater into drinkable fresh water? Today we will talking about this one. Watch this video. Hi, this is David from Chanka Water Treatment. Now we are going to high school years and remember from same classes osmosis process. When we drink water, our body or our cells absorbs water by osmosis process. Let's we remember osmosis process. You think there are two types of water in a cup and separated with semi-permeable membrane. One section has concentrated water, other side has fresh water. Membrane allows just water pass through, doesn't allow other matters to pass because of molecule size. Such as salts cannot pass the membrane. Naturally, water passes from lower concentrated fresh water site to more salty or high concentrated solution site. This is called as osmosis and it is naturally happened. No need additional force from outside. So when you drink fresh water, water goes into cell because cell inside concentration is higher. But when you drink seawater, because of high salt concentration of seawater, cells force water molecules out in order to reset balance. So water goes out from cell inside. As a result, you drink seawater and your cells are losing water. Cell dehydration can cause people die. How we can make fresh water from seawater? How we can remove salt from seawater? We talk about osmosis process at the beginning of video. In osmosis process, water naturally tends to go concentrated water site. If we reverse this process, water goes from salty or concentrated site to less concentrated site. To make this one, we need outside force. It is pressure. We force seawater pass through semi-permeable membrane. Because of size of molecules, water pass. But bigger molecules like salt, minerals, bacteria and viruses, which are bigger than water molecules, do not pass through membrane pores and we get a fresh water. We call this process seawater desalination process with reverse osmosis membrane. Now we see some of our project cases to desalinate water and gain fresh water. We design system based on number one, water source, number two, water analysis report, number three, treated water usage or application, number four, your budget. Water source and analysis report is important to design system for a technology side, such as what is the flow rate, which pressure we have to apply, which type of membrane we have to use, and so on. Application or treated water usage is also another important parameter to design system because some application need very high grade poor water such as pharmaceutical industry. We have to reduce total dissolved solids TDS less than 1 ppm. But if it is for irrigation for some cases 500 ppm is enough for treated water. Your budget is also another issue material selection, brand selection, adding some additional accessories and tools into the system. It depends on your budget. Now we see our 100 liter per hour seawater desalination system. Our customer is from Maldives and used this system in his boat for tourist sightseeing tour. This system is very suitable for home, boat, resort and small scale hotels. In one hour, you can get 100 liter water. If you added a water storage tank, you can stock water. Your system doesn't need to work all the time. Here, another project is about 25 cubic meter per hour. Our customer is from Philippines and uses this system for a community living in an island. 
where there is no any fresh water. So they have just one option. It is to turn sea water to fresh drinking water. Also customer has electrical problem at island and we solve it with solar panel application. Sometimes our customers say that they need fresh water, they have just sea water source, but they will stay there for a period, maybe six months, maybe one year, and then go to another location to start new project. They don't want to waste their money to make a building for desalination system. And also mostly there is no electric power. Chang'e containerized solar desalination plant is very suitable for this kind of case. Here some of our containerized solar powered water treatment system. It is plug and play system. You just need inlet, outlet and wastewater outlet piping and connect main electric power cable. It's done. To learn more how does reverse osmosis system work, I put a link here for you. If you have a question or you want to get offer for your project, you can send email or call us. Thank for watching our video. If you want to see more video like this, please don't forget to subscribe our channel, click like button and open notification by clicking bell icon. Thank you to watch our video. Bye bye.